Hey everyone, welcome to Fox Tech. And in this video, we're gonna walk you through how you can use the text to speech feature on CapCut. This feature is really useful for adding voiceovers to your videos without needing to record your own voice. Anyways, whether you're working on a personal project or anything else, you might find it handy. So let's just get started. At first, you need to have CapCut app. So open it up and start a new project or open an existing one. Once you're in your project, add the video you want to work with on the timeline. This is the foundation, of course. We need to have it in there. So this is where we're going to be applying the text to speech feature. Next, we need to add the text that you want to convert to speech. Make sure that your video is not selected on the timeline to avoid any confusion and click on the text button, then choose add a text and just type in the exact phrase that you want to be uh, showing in the video and the, the, the one that is supposed to be spoken, right? So this text will later be transformed into speech. After you have done that and entered your text, ensure it is selected in the timeline. Look at the options available at the bottom and you'll find you should be at least able to find the text to speech option. So click on it to proceed with the next step. Now it's time to choose the voice for your text. CapCut offers a variety of voices, some of which are free while others may be part of the pro subscription. So it's up to you to decide what you have, how much you want to go into this, but you can preview each voice to hear how it sounds and decide which one fits best with your video, right? So you can go through them and decide um, thoroughly if you want. Once you've selected the voice, you'll need to generate the speech. So click the uh, tick button to confirm your choice and CapCut will then process your text and generate the corresponding audio. This audio will automatically be added to your video timeline aligned with the text you input. To ensure everything sounds good, play back your video, listen to the newly added voice and you can make adjustments as needed, right? But this is essentially all that you need to know about it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, make sure to hit the thumbs up, subscribe below, and I'll catch you in the future.